for Fred Herco. Yesterday, I was reading about a dancer. He hurled himself out a window on Cornelia Street in the village in the 60s. Years later, his friend describes the moment before falling as a perfect jeté. On Wall Street, years later, the Dow drops sharply. Historically, this activity is casually accompanied by images of men falling in suits, not naked like a queer dancer, poised, framed by a window just between leaping and falling. Usually it's the falling people tend to notice, usually from the street. Everyone's eyes turned to the spectacle of falling. No one sees the hole left by it. No one is looking to the hole left in our understanding. Here's the thing. A building is made up of holes. So many ways of entering, exiting. You walk into a site, say rubble, something taken apart without insight. There's nothing to not enter through. You step across an imaginary boundary, separating the sidewalk from the past. Too many holes have been cut. Doors, windows, their frames firmly planted in nostalgia. Piece by piece or all at once. I want instead one clean, sharp incision. I want instead a stoop poised un interrupted on clean, hard concrete.